Hello, we're going to make a video today and this video will demonstrate how you can change the size of the remote desktop display. Okay, here we are on a Windows terminal. We're going to do a Microsoft remote desktop into another machine. We click on the start button, click on all programs, come up to accessories, and then we come down and click on remote desktop display. Uh, we're going to click on the show options button here and then we're going to go into display. <clears throat> here the um, display is set for 640 by 480 and if we go ahead and uh, come back in here to general you can see I'm going into a, mach a machine that, um, whose name I know and then I'm going to click connect and then it's going to ask me for my password Okay, I'm going in with the, I guess like the level 2 encryption. It's going to ask me about this. Um, I'm not going in at the highest encryption. And uh, that's okay. I'm going to click yes. And you can see the size of the window that it makes. Um, now this is a um, 800 uh, pixel thing here on, in the background. So the 640 um, covers most of it, but it still doesn't cover the whole thing. Uh, so what we're going to do now is we're going to log off <coughs> and we'll go to all programs, accessories, uh, remote desktop and I'm going to click the show options again and I'll click the display and this time as I said this machine behind uh, 800 by 600 <coughs> uh, so that actually this will probably take up the whole display but say you want a full screen if you take it all the way to the right no matter what your display is it will display full screen and, uh, and then if you we come up here back into general I see that what machine I'm going into I click connect and then and it's going to question me about my encryption there we go my remote desktop screen is now uh, or my remote desktop display is now full screen. Okay, that's all there is to changing the size of your remote desktop display, and uh, I hope this was helpful. Thanks for listening.